Yes, we are back. Back again in Train Sim Mode 4. Back again to do some more trips. This time in and out of Brighton. Uh, yes, going to be starting from here at East Croydon. Not in the train, you're thinking. Uh, Class 700 down to Brighton. Uh, they're going to be coming out of Brighton along the East Coastway uh, down to its end. I can't remember. Turn around back to Brighton and then see if we can come back up to here. So not all the way to the Londiniums. But we're going to come in and out of here because that leads us into something that's coming next for Train Sim World 4. Uh, if you're watching this on the YouTubes, uh, hello, how you doing? Uh, this going out on a day, um, it's it's one of them, it, many, one of the days. Uh, there'll be links in the description below to where you can find uh, this uh, game route. Oh, I'm holding up a train here. Uh, there'll be a link down there to the Twitch page where you can watch me live on Twitch doing all sorts of things uh including this that's many trains and the link down there to the discord server as well uh good evening to uh shorty trent uh ethan stokey uh cn uh, i'm fine by the way um i i'm i'm fine <laughs> i don't feel coffee at all i haven't drunk much there we go that's better uh, right uh let's get back in this thing then uh oh don't turn, turn that off um yeah, we are pretty much uh, late now because I've been sat there trying to do the shot. Uh, all right, let's do that. Unlock doors on the right. Did I get the right side? No, I got the wrong side. We'll unlock doors on the left. And we'll lock the doors on the right. Yeah, it's close enough. Uh, right, let's open some windows. There we go. Uh, are there lights to reverse us in forwards? I don't know how these things work. Uh, cab lighting off, windscreen wipers, exterior lights, daylight. There we go. Yes, yeah, so we're, we're now holding up um, things. Oh, we on. Holding up many. I could have just sat there and watched that rail cam shot. We've got a red as well. Can I do Blackpool branches? I need to do that again soon, actually. I will. Uh, remind me, and I'll go back to that in a couple of weeks' time. Next week's going to be the new train uh, in Scotland, so maybe the week after. We haven't done Blackpool in a little while. Right, go via Purley. We've got a red, so we can't really. I also want to see tonight how busy it is in Brighton because there could be another rail cam coming in Brighton. So we want to see um, how much uh, traffic there is going to be going in and out of there. So this will be the good test uh, when we, you know, go in and go out of there. Yeah, they let the other train out because I'm late. Exactly. So I've got to wait a bit longer now. Well, that's just stopping to the side of me. We'll probably get the other stuff coming in. No, no, we don't need to contact the signal. It'll be fine. I think we're just waiting for it to go. There we go. We have the yellow. Uh, we're single-handed operation. Let's get going. Uh, hello, is it me you're looking for? So we go. Oh god, that's the wrong one. Ah, we're going Purley, Gatwick Airport, Three Bridges, Balcom, Hayward Heath, uh, Wibblesfield, Burgess Hill, Hassocks, Preston Park, and Brighton. All the way down. Yeah, flipping long unit. Twelve. Yeah, we were. I don't think I was us holding things up, but there's certainly things being held up. If, by the way, you've got London to Brighton uh, and you get the 700 as a DLC, then you can add, you can do this. I do like the noise. It is quite noisy as noises go. Hi, my bone. And you're looking forward to the 20th, are you? Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to the 20th as well. Our meet up in Londinium. 
Alright, let's give it some more of the beans. So yeah, I thought rather than do the normal stuff, the Heathrow, Ex the Heathrow Express, a long way off its track, wasn't it? Uh, the Gatwick Express, I thought we'd do some 700 action. Uh, this is Train Sim World. I think you can tell graphically. Well, hopefully you can. So this was the other station we were potentially going to do a rail cam at was this one because it's less platforms so there'll be more stuff going on so that could be quite interesting in the future we'll see how the uh, the rail cam goes in brighton all right we've got a yellow oh me mellow yellow <coughs> i really am dying uh yes i did see that about the scs thing all right, we got greens. The white train and the white train had a race. Train! I think it was the train that went in front of me, yeah. Ah, that's stopping there. Yeah, we're not stopping there. Well, good thing really, because there's no way I would have stopped. Milky Way, anybody? You're old, Colin. The red car and the blue car had a race. All that Rick could do was stop his face. It's a good thing I'm not stopping here. There's no way I'd stop. Another train. I really do like this route. Now it's busier. I'm looking forward to the improved timetable on the Scotland one. Right, 13 miles to Gatwick. So yeah, so we're going down to Brighton. We're then going to switch maps and go to East Coastway and then come out of Brighton, go to one of the ends of East Coastway, come back again and then if we get time, switch back to this map and come back up here. So we go in and out of Brighton. Can we see the bars and arrows on the roof? I can do that. When was this route improved? Um, it's it improved when the 700 got added. I've still never been to Gatwick Airport. I've never done this line. Never been to Brighton. All right. So flat out, 87 mile an hour. It's quite nice not starting at Landon. So we're starting a little bit different. Yeah, there's more frequent takes off, takes off, take off and landing. So plane spotting at Gatwick is actually quite good because of the whole one runway thing. We'll see if we survive London first. All 
Right, we've got a yellow train. Oh, don't say that. You'll have Ethan down there. He'll be reporting live from McDonald's in Gatwick Airport next week. You're not babysitting Ethan. No, uh, Michael's got Ethan's company in London. Because Michael's never been to London. <laughs> Sucks to be Michael. And you haven't spent time with Ethan yet, Colin. Uh, the weekend um, after London, yeah, so maybe the weekend after this goes live on YouTube, um, we're hoping to do a board game stream. Me, Ethan, Harry and Trent. Including Scrabble. So that's one to get your popcorn for. I just got to work out the tech part of it. Right, so we've got 7.4 miles, three miles, uh, to Gatwick. Then we're carrying on down to Brighton. That can end well for Trent. It'll be hilarious. Yes, exactly. And I've got various versions. I'm going to get like my first Scrabble. I've got various versions of Scrabble. I think I'm going to just going to get, you know, the, the baby edition. We'll start with that. It may even be a two-nighter. So if it goes well on the Saturday night, we may come back for more on the Sunday night. So keep that one in your diary. And I think it'll be the Stevie just sat getting slowly drunk in the corner. Right, let's slow down. So we've got the 80. Yeah, we did a, a Discord stream of us playing board games on New Year's Eve. If it wasn't a public thing, it was just in the Discord to a few people. So we had a top-down camera uh, and it's all it was was me pretty much saying for the whole night, stop moving the effing board! Because people kept moving it and moving the board. So I've got to try and find a way of keeping the board still. Right, 4.8 miles, gaffer tape. You can't do that because it's going to be different games, isn't it? I think it may just be a bit of blue tack. Other blue sticky substances are available. <laughs> White yet? Yeah, there are other coloured tacks. I would have thought I'd have seen more trains on this bit. It's, we're a bit lacking, aren't we? White tack isn't toxic. So if Ethan eats it, it's not going to kill him. Can you play with it? Well, no, that's Play-Doh you're thinking of. You can get Scrabble on the computer uh, and on your iPad. Um, but I'm also thinking that if this works with the whole top-down camera and the audio's fine and the stream's fine, then I'd like to do 
something like that again because I've always fancied I know a lot of people do it on the internet I've always fancied just doing a bit of a um, like a Lego build or something like that so we'll see what happens right we have double yellows Oh god, no. Monopoly always ends up with someone stealing from the, the bank and then someone just storming off. I don't think anybody in the history of Monopoly has ever completed a game Monopoly without one of those two things up at all. Uh, Skippy! Uh, thank you very much indeed. 40 of the months. Yeah, but I bet, I bet Ethan's never played Monopoly. Well, I've got loads of more games. Scotland Yard we played during my birthday in February. Uh, which was great, so I'd like to do that. Uh, I'd love to do Escape from Colditz. Uh, no, that sound effect hasn't changed. Yeah, Scotland Yard's fantastic. Has it? Well, it may have changed. Oh no, it's a different one. Resubscribing and subscribing are now different. If someone subscribes, it's different to the resubscribe. There was an update. But I need to change some things. Right, we have a red. I can't remember what it was. That's the problem. Too much change. You don't like change. Oh, it was that one, wasn't it? Okay. I will look at it after the stream. Right, so I'm guessing we're waiting here for, well, a train. But that's now gone. Right, 1.2 miles to Gatwick. So, making our way down to Brighton, switching maps to East Coastway, trundling off down there. I don't think there's any other trains you can use on East Coastway. Um, then come back and we switch back to this one and go back to East Croydon. Because that's as far as the 700s go. I do want to spend a little bit of time, if I can, um, at Gatwick to see if there is a lot of trains going in and out. Gatwick? No. Brighton. Why did I say Gatwick? I knew what I meant. It's, I've had a day. Oh, I see. Is that train in front stopped here? The worky thing was just intense, I think, is the word to describe today. And not, I wasn't in a camping shop. This thing does make some strange noises. I need a holiday. You have no idea, Colin. I don't think anybody does. Uh, right. It does sound like a burglar alarm. Sound the alarm! Sound the alarm! is I and Simpova and I just threw your damn palm tree overboard no one watching will get that reference uh, okay we're stopping here with Katowic airport it is Tuesday is it it is I thought it was Wednesday for the majority of today.
There's a lot of trains here. This could be quite interesting. But I suppose this is only getting the same amount of trains as further up the line, isn't it? Because they all go through either of them. Either of them? Both of them. Some of them. It is Choo Choo Tuesday. Oh, is there anybody else? I'm guessing there's a few railway people. Hang on. No. I can't do the rail cam here because you'd get that. Uh, that one. Did anybody else, by the way, that's what I was meant to say, watch Jeff Marshall's video yesterday. Um, the chat with the guy that did the, the rail atlas thing. I want that. That seems a really interesting book. Watch the watch the vid, the chat. It's really good. Uh, I was going to do City Transport Simulator Tram tomorrow night. Um, however, I think it might be uh, Railroads Online tomorrow night. But yeah, I, I will be doing more tram. I really like that. So maybe in a couple of weeks. It may be Railroads Online if I get it installed. Right, so we've got 2.7 miles to go to three bridges. Give me more of this then. Well, I could. I could do a poll in the Discord. What do you want to see tomorrow night? Tram, railroads online, or more trains in world? <laughs> Last time I went on a plane, five years ago, I think. Well, they're waiting to go in. One of them's waiting for me, I think, to get out of the way. Right. Well, I meant in this... Okay. Oh, well, there we go. There's a poll going, apparently. You can vote to see what you want to see tomorrow night. Ethan being useless. That's normal, isn't it? How am I four minutes late? Because it's me. Oh, there's another train being held at the red down here. What's going on northbound? Why are there trains stacking up? Well, two votes to, at the moment. Trains in World 4 is the solution. Right, 1.2 miles to three bridges, making our way down. No, so you, you buggered that up then, Ethan, is what you're saying. See, yeah, another one queuing. The world's shortest pole. And not called Gary. Right, slowly into three bridges. Right, there's a pole again. Hopefully it's on for more than 34 seconds this time. 
Right, there you go. You've got five minutes to vote to what, what you want to see tomorrow night. So if you're lurking, vote. And you can lurk again tomorrow. We won't see that you voted. We won't track you down. Oops, excuse me. I've definitely got a long one. Right, doors are unlocking on the left-hand side of the train. Uh, right. Hang on, I couldn't find the letter T on my keyboard. Oh, no, that's not the letter T. That one. Uh, so Balcom is next, uh, and then Haywards Heath, then Rivelsfield, uh, Burgess Hill, Hassocks, Preston Park, and then uh, Britain. Uh, Harry, locking doors. You only go via Balcom. Well, I want to stop there. Uh, oh yeah, go via Balcom. Well, that's not very good, is it? We can do a stoppy thing going the other way. Oh, there's, is there a service that stops it there, then? I don't know if I get time. Although, I suppose this is a shorter run, isn't it, compared to the normal full length? No, because this is 50 minutes. We, we might not get time. We might not get time to do... Brighton to the end of the the other one and then back to Brighton I can't make time train is that still queuing Oh, wow. Yeah, there's a problem going towards Gatwick, isn't there? If they're all stuck. Good thing we weren't going north. Don't forget, you can vote to what I stream tomorrow night. In the voting thing that's going on. I don't know how it works. There's some time left. Harry's not going to be happy because I think of, of the three choices, uh, I was about to say, because of the three choices, he's only in one of them. So if the two other ones win, then Harry's not in it. I didn't pick them. Someone said about trams him and someone said about doing this. <laughs> I saw stuff. Right, three miles to I go via. What about the boat game? Oh, yeah. I forgot all about that. The, the fishing ships at sea. We were going to do that, weren't we? Last time I did that, Harry was grumpy. No, no. Thursday night is um, uh, kebab chefs. No, trains in World 4. There you go, done. You can't just say, I don't like the results, do another one. This isn't the American elections.
Uh, no, no Omsi, because it's only going to be me and Harry. Everybody else in the bus company isn't around tomorrow. Ethan's got free train travel, so he's doing that. Trent's got his knitting class. I didn't do the voting thing. It wasn't my decision. Right, I know I'm going slow, so I don't know what is going to be after Malcolm. I let them vote. Yeah, I know. Right, okay, the third voting thing, you've got 10 minutes now. I think there's now four options. Two of them involve Harry, two of them don't. Try again with your voting. It's definitely going well. Which game's Harry not part of? Um, tram and train, or tram and train sim world. Uh, oh, Captain Irish, fiddly dee potatoes. Oh, top of the morning to you. Okay, that's them gone. Right, the train is not stopping here. It generally helps to play a PC game to have, you know, a PC. You could you could try it on a banana, uh, but it wouldn't necessarily work. All right, we are stopping at Hayward's Heath in 3.7 miles. Now, I watched the Minions film last night. I wasn't a fan. What I should have done is watched it first. Because chronologically, you should watch the first Minions one, and then I think it's the second Minions one, and then Despicable Me, and then Despicable Me 2. Well, yeah, because it tells you about the Minions and how they became and stuff. No. You don't have to watch them in release. You watch them in chronological order. It's a prequel. Uh, this is near Gatwick. We've been to Gatwick, yes. Gatwick is behind us with the planes and the wicks. Oh, we didn't look at the thing on the thing. The roof and the thing and the, and the, the, the biggest thing in the thing. Colin didn't remind me. We do that on the way back. We need to remind me, you dingbat. Uh, no, the reason I didn't install that is because it said that it can crash, and I didn't want it to do that during the stream. You voted. Excellent. What operator are we? Templink. Alright, 1.7 miles. We are stopping at Hayward's Heath. Well, I didn't want it to be, if it was an issue, I didn't want it to be crashing during the stream. I can cause enough issues myself. But I did look at it, hence I knew about the crashing. Oh, don't. I'm going to, every day there's flipping junk mail through my door. I'll be glad when Friday's here. Anyway, we're not doing politics. Uh, it's been 11 of the months. Uh, Daniel, thank you very much indeed. How did you manage to do that? Well, you've got past 10. But thank you very much indeed. Uh, driven 70 miles in the class 700. 
wonder if you get one for doing 700 miles in a class 700 I'd like to think so what on earth is that stupid thing there, there's been changes it wasn't me there was an update Brakes are good on this, that's something. <whistles> ah, that's close enough. There we go. I'm locking the doors. Come on, people. Thought no one liked Harry. Why would you want him to be here tomorrow night? Why would you want to go to Luton in trains in what? Why? No, it, it, it would be good if they did the whole of the Thames link. Okay, what can I hear inside and not outside? Lock doors. I'll do that then. I did that in Train Sim Classic, Brighton to Bedford. That was some years ago. Yeah. That's probably still on the YouTube somewhere. I think that was the first route I did that was several bits linked together. Right, Wibblesfield is a go via. Uh, go via Burgess Hill, stop at Hassocks, stop at Preston Park, stop at Brighton. And say so then we're going to jump to the East Coastway and then leave Brighton and go off down there. So we focus on Brighton when we get there. Purely because I want to see how busy it is at Brighton because that's the plan for the next rail cam. Right, let's go. Wivelsfield. So yeah, tomorrow something. You lot are deciding, it would seem. Uh, Thursday night. Uh, kebab chefs. Where hopefully we're going to switch restaurant. And switch map. Uh, Friday night, we got some trucking. Saturday lunchtime is going to be virtual rail cam. Saturday night, uh, to be confirmed. I don't know what that's going to be yet. Sunday lunchtime farming and then back uh, all week next week as well. Yeah, come on. There's only eight people voted. There's 30 people watching. Come on. Get voting. What do you want to see tomorrow? We want Harry to not be miserable. Why? He normally is. See, now look what you've done, Colin. Exactly, change of vote, change of vote, quick. Yeah, well, yeah, but no one pays any attention in Discord either. Right, Wibblesfield and then Burgess Hill. Where's Trent? Trent, help! No, Trent's hoping that someone else has got a bit of attention of Harry. So that Harry doesn't harass Trent. So 
here. If you've just joined, where have you been? I've been here 40 minutes. Uh, we've done a Croydon thing. We're going to Brighton, then doing Brighton to somewhere. Back to Brighton, then Brighton up to Croydon again if we can. Or at least Gatwick. Well, the poll's finished now, isn't it? Or just about to. Right, stop at Burgess Hill. Ships on the wet stuff. Really? I get a deciding vote. No. it's not good in multiplayer because you're not on the same boat so what's the point good game oh god not TTD not with two people uh, right. You let them vote. I didn't get much to choice into what the vote was. <laughs> good game, good game. <laughs> nice to see you, to see you. Dollies, do your dealing. I can't remember what the. No, I'm try, trying to make it think of the whole thing. Uh, anyway, uh, right, two miles to Hassocks. Making our way to Brighton. Yeah, at this rate, we're not going to get back to East Croydon. Keep out of the black and in the red. Nothing in this game for two in a bed. <laughs> you can't beat a bit of bully. Oh, let's look at what you could have won. In one. This beautiful tea service will see great on any coffee table. In two. You're going to look fancy in these new sheepskin coats. In three. It was like, really? I don't want to win any of them prizes. <laughs> I think I just need it. I need alcohol. I think that's going to be the solution to me in life. Right. We have a mile to Hassocks. I think I remember growing up, we had a hostess trolley. And it used to get used on a Sunday to keep like potatoes and gravy on and keep them warm. It was like six feet from the kitchen. My nan had a tea's made. Well, it wasn't all the meal was, but the excess potatoes and the gravy were on the hostess trolley. Right, we are arriving at Hassocks. If you're new to the streams, this is normal. We talk about food and general, like, rubbish. No serving hatch. No. A couple of people in the street had one. Where my folks used to live before they moved here, there was a serving hatch. Not here. 
The dining table is the other side of the wall from the kitchen, so technically you could. My niece in one of the houses in Birmingham used to have one, and the table was right the other side of it. It's actually really useful. You just pass food through the hatch. Smoking is not permitted on any part of the station. Useful to know. Thanks for that. Uh, right, we've arrived at Hassocks. I haven't seen many trains going the other way. It's been very lacking, isn't it? Have they all stopped or something because it's quarter to seven? You know, it's had a, I did the time. It's roughly right, look. It's within a couple of minutes of the actual time. See? Right. Five miles to Preston Park. Let's give it all of the beans. Right, so tomorrow it would seem uh, ships at sea. Uh, Thursday kebab chefs, Friday night trucking, Saturday lunchtime uh, virtual rail cam in this, uh, Saturday night uh, something, and then Sunday afternoon back on the farm. And then next week, hopefully, either Tuesday or Wednesday, I'll be able to show the new train and the updates uh, to the Edinburgh to Glasgow. So we'll do a bit of that. Class 380, is it? I want to say, potentially, possibly, maybe. Cathcart Circle. I know what I meant. It was it's Scotland somewhere. Oh, it's a train. The Iron Brew route. I do like the view from the cab in this. It's quite nice. So we'll go old school after this and jump in a 313. 12.99 for the 380. Well, it's, it's that and enhancements to the route, isn't it? Improved timetabling and stuff. Or is that just a core update for the route and then you pay for the train? seems expensive if it's just the train. I will find out more next week. Okay, so if you don't get it, you don't get the new timetable. Oh. Well, we'll see next week. Right, 3.6 miles to Preston Park. We've got a 75 limit coming up. Slowly it down a little bit. Train. Right, so we now should see a bit more traffic coming the other way, hopefully. As we get closer to Brighton. I hope it's busy. I 
I don't think it would be because of these coastway trains coming in and coming out as well. Well, that's not very frequent service, is it? Could you imagine if they got the licensing, how something like um, Bristol Temple Meads would be in this? With the stuff coming in and coming out. Right, braking. Oh, exactly, he's probably food time, I should imagine. Well, no, apparently they've lost the rights for, for GWR. Uh-oh. That's fine. Most of the carriage is on the platform. Yeah, it's a, it's a bit of a step. You can still type while you're doing that, can't you? We weren't asking you to speak. Too late now. Uh, right, Brighton, 1.2 miles. Uh, no, it doesn't matter. Um, you, can, you can eat with headphones on. I forgot what I was going to say. So do we want to do East Coastway or do we just want to do a return in this? I'm not going to do a poll. Plus three people. So far the consensus is Coastway. That's four. Such an engaging audience. That's five. Okay, so Coastway then. Okay. I was going to, but I just thought you might have wanted to see the return in this. They're both coming in and out of Brighton. We'll do something about the same sort of time as well in Coastway. So this is the bit where I'm hoping it's going to be busy. Because that's the East Coastway line that runs off down there. going to be a busy station. I don't know if it's going to be as busy as one of the pass-through stations.
thing is, the bit when you're eating was the East Coastway is not a very frequent service. It's not like the addition of that adds in a lot of trains. So I wonder how many trains an hour go in and out of... It's not like we're going to get a train every like minute going in and going out. Are we? The thing is, Gatwick, you've got... Wait. Well, We have a hard job. If it doesn't stop, it's going to go crashing through the barriers. And I think five, four. There's, a, there's already a train in there, so it's going to go crashing into the back of the train that's already in there. Sixteen an hour. That's one every four minutes. It's not going to be that exciting to watch, is it? I don't think Gatwick's the, the choice. I think the one south of where we did last time might be the idea. Or is there another route where there's more trains? Um, that could be the thing. Does it have to be this? Yeah, South Croydon. Right. So let's do East Coastway, which are probably going to East Coastway. There we go. Uh, yeah, Glasgow after the update could be quite good, I suppose. So we want Brighton to Lewis. Let's do that. It's only 17 minutes and then we come back again. If I choose, let's choose an early morning, uh, like 20 past 8, out of Brighton. Uh, right, uh, come on, each bloody different train works, don't you? Yeah. Uh, unlock left. Uh, there we go. Right. Uh, there we go. Right. Class 313 this time. Holy. Do any services stop there? Any timetable services stop at Hawley? We could try it on the way back. Stop just north of Gatwick. Right, okay. So what we'll do is we'll just do this out of here and then we'll come we'll jump back to here and do another one north and we'll try Hawley then and see what that's like. Uh, oh, we've got separate brakes, haven't we? There we go. Oh, so a bit of train stealing. So we go to Gatwick and then take over one that's heading north and going to Hawley. Yeah, I think this could be a bit of a 
I thought it to be good. I thought you'd be getting stuff coming in and going out all the time. So, right, we'll try that. We'll take this one to its end, bounce back to here, switch back to um, London to Brighton, go back to Gatwick in a 700. And then end at Hawley. See if we can find something early a.m. again. Or the p.m. Um, rush hour. Do a 700 controversial. So these things, no, these things aren't running down here anymore, are they? These things are now baked bean tins. We're now arriving at London Road. Okay, here's a question then. Apart from the London Underground, What's the oldest stock that's running out there on mainline routes? How old is the oldest stuff that's still running? Is it the HSTs? Or is there anything older? There's a question for you. In the UK, yeah. Molskum. How old are the three one eights then? Nineteen eighty six isn't old. Train, I see train. Again, 82 isn't old. All right, breaking. Off the front door that that works that's fine that's okay it's a li little bit of a step down from the right hand side of the front door other than that it's okay 
We're all right. Uh, hi. I think the HSTs will be, be around for a little while yet. I don't think they're going anywhere for the next few years. Until there's something that can replace them. Uh, right, far farmer is next. Oh, at least the brakes probably helps, doesn't it? 1.7 miles. Yeah. Oh, God. We'll slip. So what about things like the 150 and stuff? They're only 80s, aren't they? Eighty-nine. See, to some of you, that seems like a, a long time ago. No. Uh, absolutely. Yeah, I could get in one of these and operate it without a problem. Um, I used to say the same when we used to do a lot, lot of flight sim. Uh, I used to say a link a lot of flight simmers would say the same. Stick me in a, a Cessna 172 and I can start it. Stick me in a 737 if it had ground power. I reckon I could get it started. But yeah, one of these, yeah. What about the safety systems? Yeah, I, that. I can get it started, but if anything goes wrong, no. 172 is easy, you know. That's just... Mixture, fuel, electrics, go. Yeah, if you drove this in, obviously, train sim world with all the safety systems on, that would be quite realistic. And you see the pressure some of the drivers are under, actually. There's quite a lot to it. It's not as easy as just sit there waving your Xbox controller about. Right, so we're going to get as far as wherever this is going, Lewis. Then we're going to jump back to the other route, go from uh, Brighton to Gatwick, see if we can steal a train going to wherever it was Ethan suggested, um, and then have a look at that being a candidate for a rail cam. Which you may do this Saturday, don't know. It may be one I can do when I'm on my own. Uh, right, wait until 8.31 and four seconds. Right, Lewis, there we go, four miles. Our final stop. So yeah, tomorrow uh, going to be some ships at sea. Uh, going to give the multiplayer of that a go. See how we get on. Thursday night, Kebab Chefs, where we're moving to another new restaurant. Friday night, some trucking. Uh, this in some form on Saturday lunchtime. Saturday night, uh, something multiplayer. Uh, once again, it's not going to be Dave in for me. Uh, and then uh, Sunday lunchtime, some farming.
Hang on. Is there a version of this that runs with Panzer? Because it's got the flat bit there. We think a pantograph is. So is there a version of this that wasn't third rail? Oh, the, the Scotland one. Oh, it's the same as this. Uh, I, I like how the two geeks both responded at the same time. See, you two are made for each other. You know too much. I know a lot. I just don't put it to use here. I had a lengthy conversation about paint today. Paint. Well, that's what, that was my life for 11 years, wasn't it? Without talking about paint or tools, I could have a lengthy conversation about music, films, TV shows, cars, motorbikes. Right, breaking. Things that kind of go on YouTube too. Yes, things that I, I would only ever talk about when drunk. How's the entertainment section coming along? I did think about it uh, last night, but ended up watching an episode of Vera and then the Minions film, which is okay. A couple of bits I laughed. I think watching them in chronological order would have been better. like the Marvel stuff you need to watch the Marvel stuff in a certain order not necessarily release order I think Minions is the same right so you've arrived at Lewis Lewis guy he didn't tell me his name so it may have been Lewis or Lewis you're the guy in the professionals right wait for this to end we'll jump back to London to Brighton uh, jump in the 377 then uh, and make our way back to Gatwick see if we can then steal a train to stop at the place uh right so we will go back to the main menu oh power wash sims got an update Ooh. i do like that kind of relaxing not great from a streaming point of view uh right uh see why don't they leave them up here in the order that you you did them that would be a lot better, wouldn't it? There, let's come back down there again. Uh, right, 377. 
So we'll do a... Well, we can't do it. Yeah. Well, we can't. That's Rygate. So we can't leave Brighton. Field. London Bridge. So, yeah, there's nothing going from Brighton. It doesn't start till later. Okay. Oh, hang on. Right into Lover's Walk. Turn music down. Right into Victoria. There we go. Ten o'clock. That's right. We did this one. Right. A stupid thing starting and flipping halfway through the day. Well, why don't I do a 387 then? <sighs> you just can't get the staff, can you? Uh, right. Oh, God, no, don't do that. No, don't do... Why, why have I done that? <sighs> Hang on. There we go. Uh, where's the lights up here? Tail lights, auto, headlights. Day running. There we go. Oh, it's the same as this, though, isn't it? What's the train leaving over there? I suppose now it's busy. Right, where are we stopping? Uh, Hassocks, Burgess Hill, Hayward Teeth, Gatwick. Right, then we're going to get out and see if we can steal something. Let's go Hunter Baldy. Oh. Uh, it did seem to be no passengers. Why did they start putting these seats three wide? It's just... Mm. Anyway. Yeah, we seem to be lacking in the passengers. Uh, no, you didn't miss the bars and arrows. We're stopping there on the way back. See, this would have been the idea for a, a rail cam. Something like this. I don't know if I've only got a minute. But we'd have had long periods of time with like nothing going on. Yeah, I was looking at that. I do like them. Hello, me. Looking good. Uh, right.
Right, onwards then, to Hassocks. So I'm guessing they were used in the, in the early morning rush. And that had been shoved down there out of the way. Right, looking back back out of a letterbox. A couple of years ago I wouldn't drive these things. I'd only drive ones with a view. I've still got used to them now. Anything's better than that stupid thing on the Edinburgh to Glasgow. Stupid slanty little windows. What is going on with that audio? the wind noise. That's better. Right, we should be a little bit quicker going back as well, hopefully. See how busy it is as well coming down. All right, ninety limit, four miles to go. So we're taking this as far as Gatwick. Then we've got to try and find the train we want to take over that will stop where we want to stop. Problem is then, we want to get it out of the way. So we then got to maybe, if we get time, spawn in a train in a siding somewhere so we don't block the main lines. what we did when we did the last rail cam. So hopefully there's something by the side of uh, where we need to be. Hawley. Think of Horlicks. Tunnel. We don't need the light on, it's fine. Right, 
Right, I don't know how good the brakes are as well. I'm guessing we're going to find out. Another train. Uh, probably not. Oh, that's fine. I wasn't worried about the braking at all. Most of the trains on the platform as well. That's a plus. I now don't know if it's going to let me go because I, I went into emergency. I'm guessing we'll find out. Yeah, a driver wouldn't be turning his lights on and off because they rely on the signals, don't they? In the middle of the countryside, they don't. They don't have like main beam. Right, Burgess Hill in two miles. Another train going the other way. Okay, certainly busier down here. What you want, really, if you're doing a rail cam, you want a station where you're getting some stoppers and some straight throughs. I think the thing we have with the Croydon one is that everything pretty much was stopping. So it sits there a while. You want some that are just dashing straight through. We'll see. Yeah, I don't know if we'll do it this Saturday. I said if Ethan's here. Then we may just let him do a route himself like he did last time. And then I'll, I'll do it the following Saturday. So yeah, so we're going to take this as far as Gatwick, then hopefully we'll catch one of the trains that is stopping at Hawley. I don't know how we're going to know that. Actually, we could just catch the train stopping at Hawley. That'd be different. Time to get in. I don't know. The difference between what time I get in and what time I should get in. I should get in at uh, 10.30. Uh, doing good.
Right, locked doors. Right, 3.7 miles to Haywards Heath. Yeah, it's going to be interesting then, isn't it? If the timetable's improved for Glasgow, with the Cathcart, is it Glasgow? Whichever one it is, Cathcart Circle, um, Edinburgh, Glasgow, one of them, then is that going to be busy? I think we will want a really busy station. Which I know comes down to licensing. So it's what trains they've got the license for, what liveries they've got the licensing for. Waterloo. Thing is, you want a pass through station. You don't want a station that's all terminal is 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 You wouldn't want um, New Street. You want something on a main line. What about Reading? Although well, Reading's in, but there's no AI. Imagine in years, years and years time when I'm long stop doing this you get the Elysee Perp lines coming into Reading can you imagine getting the Elysee Perp line in this what about Sheffield yeah just something like that on, on a main line where it's a pass through station need to do is look at these stations and see how frequent trains are coming and going. Oh god. I forgot it was a separate combined power handle. It's probably switching from one to the other. There's a lot of lines here. We shall see how busy Hawley is when we get there. Oh yeah, if it's not busy, we're blaming Ethan. Well yeah, because you said go there. That's what we're doing. And if we get there and it's not busy, you're being blamed. a train and you can tell that by the way that you know it's a train Please note that 
That's a long one. That's definitely quite lengthy as lengthiness goes. A long time opening the doors. You open the doors, AI, or are you just going to leave the doors closed? Passengers are like, come on, is Nico guarding this? Oops, oh, there we go. Finally, yeah, Nico is guarding that. Right, 11 miles then to Gatwick. Let's go. It may not work, so it may not be that busy because of the time of the day, but we'll see. You're sorry, so you should be. You know what you did. you do it took too long opening the doors at least you are again at some point the roblox thing we never went back to the theme park roblox thing either so many things well apart from our um london meetup in a couple of weeks time I'm around for weekends. Bath member in August. So uh, weekend streams be back to normal now. All right, well, a couple of yellows. So is this going to be double yellow, single yellow, red? Yes. Just when we start getting a bit of speed. I feel the need, the need for speed. Do the slow leaning towards the red, which has now gone the yellow colour. Right, we'll maintain this sort of speed. I'm guessing there was a train in the station in front of us. God, I hope it isn't that queue <laughs> heading northbound. Definitely following something.
I want to slow it down a bit until we get greens. Hopefully we're not going to follow this something all the way to Gatwick. Otherwise we're not going to catch that 10.33. Where's our first green? Uh, still got yellows. See if we can build a little bit of speed up if it'll let us. Right, still get a few more trains coming south. Five and a half miles. Yeah, surprising what the addition of one train makes. We stuck at a red. Well, hopefully, it's not the queue that we saw on the way down. So it is, we're not going to make that ten thirty three. Uh, hi, Louis. Come on, light. Change. Go. Well, it gets us through the platform. So it has, it's just left the platform, which means they'll probably be stuck behind it now coming into Gatwick.
Yeah, we're definitely not doing three miles in like a minute, are we? Not as we're chasing stuff. Quite like this, though. The fact that we are stuck behind other trains. Yeah, we've got the yellow. Is that going to be a red, the other side of the yellow, though? No. We got the green all the way in. Or is that red going to be this side of the platform? Yellow. Is that train's going to be behind us then, isn't it? The one we need to catch. Unless it's already in. Oh, it starts at Gatwick. Oh. So we're going to see it leave as soon as we arrive. Well, providing the timetabling's right. on platform four as the train's just left there. There it is. Oh, yep. Please do not leave vehicles unattended at the drop-off point. The, the biggest... Can't get any higher. Oh, there you go. Is it red in real life? I thought it was white. Oh, he's red. Okay. Right. So what we need to do then is get out of here. Wander down to platform one and have a look. How long have we got to wait? Oh god. I've gone any further than that. Oh, 
Platform 1, Cambridge. So it's not that one. The Bedford. Oh, so I'm behind the Cambridge. Oh. Oh, there's 11.03. It's a minute behind. Okay. And there's nothing else that stops there. Is there a track here that's not being used? I wonder if I could just spawn a train in. I could do a bit of... Uh, yes, it would give up control. Thank you. Uh, he's driving off with his door open. That went well. I really like the idea of just being a passenger and going up to there. Problem is we then need we need to put a train in there then, wouldn't we? So we're there. How far up is it here? There's some sidings here, up there. Yeah. So I'm wondering, what if I spawned a train in here and then took it into the siding up there? Would it change the track? Let's spawn mm. something. I always get the wrong bloody button. It's always third attempt. So I set my path to there. Right, there we go. Is it actually going to give me the signal at some point though? That's the problem. Oh, it is. Green. Why is this red on my left? Oh yeah, the little shunt signal. Oh yeah.
aspetta Right, let's stop it here then. Where well, there's no buffers. That's safe. as close as we can get that I think there's no sidings down here so we shall fly So you want a view of the platform because you want to see the stopping ones, don't you? This is where there'll be nothing now. Oh no, it's something. Don't know how frequent they're going to be. I suppose it's not peak, or it's quarter to eleven in the morning. So I'm guessing we're not in peak timetable. Or do they just run constantly throughout the course of the day? We have one going northbound so far. Well, there's nothing on that northbound um, display. 
unless they all stop on this platform on the left all the two platforms on the left so these platforms on the right not used if they're not there's someone still over there oh here's one Hi, Connor. Uh, Ring it is for a few minutes just to see what it's um what it's like train wise i think east croydon was busier but it's because i picked the right time of day with the same trains go through here that went through there yeah I don't think this is a great candidate I think I think I think it's going to be as busy as East Croydon, though. Do we? I thought Brighton might have been, but Brighton isn't. This isn't. Okay, that cut off. But again, where it's because it's not peak. Ten to eleven in the morning. Yeah. I don't think I could spawn in. If I went on foot. Uh, London to Brighton. Do it for our service, yeah, but nothing would go. Oh, okay. So, I'm that then, didn't I? Three seven seven. So that, our oh, pearly to East Croydon. But I want to get out of this train then, don't I? And spawn something else in. Hopefully there's a siding or something somewhere. Is there going to be anything that isn't going to be used? Uh, oh, it's stuff over there. Yeah, this. That'll do, donkey. Uh, 
Anybody know where the off switch is? Well, I could just leave this chugging away in the corner, couldn't I? That's true. There we go. Let's turn it off. We're at the southern end. Why the southern end? What difference does it make? The same trains go through. Two trains becoming one. What? Probably got. Probably got canopies. So you're not going to see much because they're canopies. You can't rise up because... Because of the canopies. You can see even less now because you've got bloody roofs in the way. Right, so if the canopies weren't there, go back. Yeah, if the canopies weren't there, it would probably be better. Where's that come from? What's come from around there? Well, yeah, that's what we're just looking at to see if it is busy. Oh, I see that's just split. That's now formed two trains. So what Ethan's saying is there's, there's going to be a train coming in and we'll join up with that one on the second platform and then that will sod off and form one long train. I didn't realise they actually did that. 
Boy, we're going to have to wait for that now, aren't we? I didn't realise they do. I didn't realise they did it. It was modelled in the game. That was a worky thing. Busy today. There you go. There's a train coming in there on the same platform as this one. Uh, yeah, what I might do with the Minions ones is I might watch them again in the correct order. Which isn't the order they released in. I think it would make more sense. Or now watch the second Minions film, then the first Despicable Me film. Right, so those two trains on the other side here that are far apart, they should couple and form one train. Well, no, because I watched Despicable Me 1 and 2. There you go, look, it's going to couple up now, look. Despicable Me 1 and 2, but the Minions is before Despicable Me 1. And I think Minions 2 is before Despicable Me 1. So you should watch Minions, Minions 2, Despicable Me 1, 2, 3, and then 4. Oh, there you go. Right, so they've just coupled. So at some point they're going to sod off. That's quite cool. So what happens to this one down here then? Where's this one going? Right, doors are open now on the full train. Oh, so that whole thing now goes into London. Of course I've seen Toy Story. I've got all the Toy Stories. Uh, new one's being recorded, isn't it? Be out next year. Toy Story 5. Yeah, it's not as busy a station as Croydon. It's 6.45 a.m. Well, I suppose. Paddington is in this. Uh, but only in Great Western Express, so there's not many trains. Oh, there you go. Doors are opening on this one now. Look. So those poor passengers have been there all that time waiting to get off. Like, we want to get off. Yeah, so this one here is going to go that way. So it's got the green. And then that long one then is going to go off that way, which it hasn't got the, the green yet, uh, towards Londinium. But yeah. Oh, that's, that's it. The London one's got the green now. Right, this one's going that way. Right, 
right, is that London one going to depart now? Then we have none of the trains. Doors are still open. Oh, there we go. so quiet there we go so yeah i think before we do rail cam uh i think we need to find the right station um something like this that's quite interesting where it splits um i think something where like that you can move around i'm not gonna do a fixed rail cam but something like that where we can move it around and discuss what's going on without actually driving a train. But it needs to be something where there is a lot going on. Um, I, I do like that aspect. So, yeah. But yeah, I don't Please like this. Please do not leave vehicles unattended at the drop-off point. Vehicles left unattended may be clamped or removed without warning. Okay. Short and long stay car parks are provided at this station. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm not a fan of this station because of the canopies from a rail cam point of view. Um, but yeah, something like that. We will find something. Um, so yeah, this Saturday lunchtime then, probably just normal train sim world. Until we can find the perfect station. Maybe... The Cathcart Circle, if that's got more trains running on it, that could be interesting. So there we go. Uh, more trains then back on Saturday lunchtime uh, doing something. Yeah, the American ones might. That was only brilliant because of oh, the issues we had. Um, next stream, though, tomorrow night back uh, on the water doing some ships at sea in multiplayer uh, with Harry. Thanks to you lot. Uh, Friday night, no, Thursday night, we got some kebab chefs. Uh, Friday night, some trucking and tunes. Say so Saturday lunchtime, train sim world. Uh, Saturday night, uh, something multiplayer. I don't know what yet. Uh, and then Sunday lunchtime, uh, back on the farm doing some farming. And then more stuff back next week, including the class 380. Uh, you will be seeing it next week. Hopefully, I can show it to you before release. Uh, release is next Thursday, so it could be next Tuesday or Wednesday. Uh, I'll be doing the class 380 so we'll have a bit of that uh, so there we go uh, so thanks to you lot in chat um, for keeping me company for the last couple of hours uh, to uh, Skippy and Daniel for resubscribing uh, thank you very much indeed uh, I will be back then with an annoying green one uh, tomorrow night to play on the water until then if you have been thanks very much for watching <laughs>